Guys, we get asked questions quite frequently. This is a little bit of a curly one because it's a little bit different to what most people do with their garages. This is more set up for work mats and to make sure you don't have trip hazards. But what do you do if you have an internal corner? Because the edges, you can't clip them on, so you have to trim them. So I'm just gonna show you quickly and briefly how to do this so that you can negate any trip hazard and get on with what you wanna do. Let's do it. So for the internal corner side of things, what you want to do is you want to have them, you don't even need them to be in the location, you just need to have them and make sure they're at 90 degree right angles. That little point there is going to match up with whatever that point there is. So that should be the right point. Now if we switch that over as well, that should then match up. So that can probably come in just, oh hang on, we're not at 90 degrees, there we go, let's do that. Yep, there we go. So we know that we're gonna trim from here to here and here to here. Let's trim them up. Right, let's see if these fit. And I'm gonna knock them in because I, I have some confidence, hopefully, that these will look perfect. And there we have it. An internal corner. I feel like I've surprised myself. Um, that's how you do it. If you have any questions or queries, or even if you know you've got an internal corner, um, but you're not sure you're gonna get that, if you tell us, we can actually pre-cut these for you so that we can get that perfect for you too. Alrighty, there we go. Hey guys, thanks so much for tuning into our videos. If you wanna see a bit more of what we're doing, hit the subscribe button so you know when we're dropping new content and the like button so that we know that that's what you like and we'll make more of that sort of stuff. Alrighty, catch yous.